The phase four of the Operation Halt 2 was carried out between Thursday 27th and Saturday 29th May 2021. This time round, the operation, which was carried out by 420 military personnel from all ranks, was focused on the river Ancobra and its tributaries at Bunsa in the western region. The objective of the exercise was to enforce the 100-metre radius limit for mining activities around the river bodies. The team, after the three-day exercise, seized and destroyed equipment used in perpetrating the illegality while persons involved in the act were arrested. A total of 592 assorted items were destroyed in the process. Out of that number, 24 excavators, 341 chamfan machines and platforms, 123 water pumping machines, grinding machines, wooden accommodation structures, six motorbikes and other equipment were seized and destroyed. A total of 592 assorted items were destroyed. 592 assorted items were destroyed. You can see fire burning some of the items. Was three Chinese nationals and there are two Ghanaian drivers were arrested. So in this case, five persons have been arrested. Three Chinese nationals and two Ghanaian counterparts. The breakdown of the items that were destroyed are as follows. Excavators, 24. Meanwhile, the Operation Halt team is being affected by the 100 metre radius limit for mining along the water bodies. According to the Defence Minister, during their exercise, they observed many illegal miners had moved their equipment away from the 100-metre radius to create the false picture of not mining. They called for a review of the law. It was observed that some illegal miners had moved their mining equipment, particularly excavators, to just nearby communities. So you are passing, you can see huge excavators standing in communities. But they've moved them out of the 100-metre zone. But you can see that this, this is a little a community and then you have 10, 20 excavators standing there. You know that they, they, they were using to do illegal things, but because it's not within the 100 meters, you cannot destroy them. So the armed forces will pass and move on. We need to take a decision about some of these things as a government and as a people. Troops chance upon 11 excavators that have been moved two kilometers away from the illegal mining site along the river and cobra with the possibility of course of illegal miners they redeploying the equipment at an opportune time so that's what happened you go and see these excavators standing there they have just moved them they could clearly see that they had destroyed the river bodies but what they did is to move them off from there we will take a decision on this this equipment we will take a decision very very soon on them because we know they will want to go back answering questions on the prosecution of arrested illegal miners in the ongoing exercise, Information Minister Kojo Opon Kroma disclosed that five cases were in court for the necessary prosecution and conviction. The accused persons on the 11th of May 2021 were arraigned before the Kofodia Circuit Court B on uh, provisional charges, namely two counts of conspiracy to commit crime, uh, that's reconnaissance for minerals, um, and reconnaissance for uh, minerals without lawful authority. Um, the accused persons were arrested by the town folk themselves, as you remember. They had dug deep hundreds of meters into the ground, um, and they were actually conducting some mining activities there without lawful authority. 